We got Crash, of course. He's always anxious to get get on the equipment. So we can start setting rocks to the left and the right side. Well, good morning. It's Thursday morning at the Owens job. We've only been here about a half hour and uh, we already got a rock set. So I'm always nervous about getting the first rock set because you're kind of trying to figure out where to start and the next rock we're going to set is a similar rock to this now on the left side so I can get this left side ledge up to the level of the second ledge and build from there. We got Crash operating the excavator. We're swinging the rocks in with the excavator and we're bringing the rocks up to the excavator with the Terex. Those are our other stones we're going to use to start building the base. So let's strap her up and see how she goes. The second rock we set worked out perfectly to go to the right of the first rock. They're both about the same height and they fit really seamlessly together. Be a great foundation to put some bigger boulders on top. So one, two, three. We're on a roll. Let's keep up this pace. I like it. Now the idea over here, I'm going to create a mini grotto. We're going to put a big chunky boulder here that stands about four foot tall and then one on the right side and then a grotto rock over the top so there'll be like a little swim cave. And right here, this pipe sticking up is for an LED light so we can have a light right inside the grotto so it'll illuminate the grotto and be beautiful. Another cool little light basin feature. We got to create some sort of little light grotto where that light is right there. Then of course we have the main grotto to the left of that right here. Going to create another little light basin or grotto right there. And then another one right there. So it's going to be beautiful because you're going to have all this falling water with light behind it. So it's going to be a really cool feature. So there we are. One, two, three, four rocks set in maybe like two hours. Everything is flowing really good today. The next one, give me the one with the lichen. I be liking the lichen. I be liking the lichen a lot. Well, we barely fit the machine in, but I can't turn all the way. You can see that bar on the machine wants to hit the wall. So we can't reach all the way around to get the rocks. So we're going to try to get the rocks in through this hole in the grotto with the other machine and we'll just reach down and grab them from there. Well, it's getting pretty interesting. We cr created this grotto and we first set this flat rock right behind that pipe so it was a very shallow grotto. Then we decided, because we have all this space behind it that we would have had to fill, we moved the flat rock back towards the wall creating a deeper grotto and then right where Jane is standing and Phil, we're going to leave it open and create a cave that gets taller as the waterfall tapers up to the height of the main grotto and make a secret walkway from this little cave to the big cave for the kids to play in. We've never done that before. Hey, what do I smell? Rubber burning. Oh, check the uh, mixer. Oh, the mixer's jammed. He's not keeping an eye on his mud. All right, pick it up, pick it back up. I'm gonna put the camera down, help you out. So, day run, day one on the rock work. Day run. <laughs> I can't even talk, I need to eat. It's quarter to three, I think we'll finally take lunch. <laughs> Creating our little grotto right in there. Then a nice cascading waterfall back to the big main grotto. Got this big rock overhanging the left side. It's gonna be awesome. Back where that inch and a half pipe stubbed up, it's gonna be a light and a little walkway right along behind all that rock work behind where Chris is and then walk through where Jane is down into the little grotto where there's another light. That's going to be cool because we never made a little secret passageway from, from one grotto to the next. And then the next trick is to find a rock to go from the skimmer area to this other little light cave right in there. <laughs> 